Who opened the door? This is so cool! <laughs> oh, that's not very cool. coolest horror game that we've played this year. Think At Dead of Night, the ultra realistic FMV movie game mixed with like midnight scenes, those pixely games. Yeah, it, it's pretty cool. Yo, what's going on YouTube? And welcome to Tenebrous Somnia. This is a brand new demo for this game that just barely released today. So if y'all do want to see the full gameplay of this when it does release, make sure to like the video and subscribe to the channel. And welcome to the full demo of Tenebrous Somnia. Every night I have the same nightmare. I see my ex-boyfriend being killed by horrible creatures. I didn't talk to him again after we broke up, but these dreams don't let me rest. I tried to contact him without success. I still have the key to his apartment. Oh, his apartment's on the third floor. Okay. Okay, so now, listen, I know how some of y'all feel about the pixel games. Just bear with me for a second here, okay? Uh, third floor, so we're gonna get in the elevator. Nice. Just, just, just trust. We lived together here for a couple of years until I left. For a while, it was hard for me to stop calling it our apartment and think about it as his apartment. I guess the same thing happens with the key that weighs in my pocket. It's no longer our key, it's his key. It's kind of weird that you kept that, I'm not gonna lie. Why did I keep it all this time? I don't know, that's what I'm asking. A little strange. This time, I will not take it home again. All right, so we're gonna leave the key at his apartment. Uh, that's a cute painting. Right. There we go. Yvonne, are you there? I knock, but there's no answer. All right, um, because we're using the key and we're gonna break in. Yikes, dude. I believe this is a terrible idea. You're gonna go in there and see something that you don't wanna see. What if he's with another girl? I mean, I know you're not together anymore, but I'm sure he's okay. Positive thinking, okay. Positive thinking for me too. It's still the typical apartment of two movie fans. Oh, that's kind of cute. Well, only one now. Mm -hmm. These are movies and film festival posters. All right, here we keep receipts, papers, and anything bureaucratic. So you can interact with basically everything in these games, right? These are cans where he kept Devour, the short film he made in film school. That's cool. They're empty, don't know why they're on the floor. Chemistry books. He was always interested in working with film and hated recording on video or digital. Thanks to these books, he was able to film and develop his own short. Okay, there's one glaring thing in the room. This thing, the study door does not open. It's sealed by this weird substance. At least it's not blood. Looks like some kind of very hard red wax. Are you in there, Yvonne? Lots of books about cinema. Many of them are mine. Should I take them with me? No. I mean, I guess you could. That's a weird room, man. He's doing some something weird. And the TV's broken. Someone broke the TV. I don't like this at all. Oh, uh, what if this thing on the ground? What's that? Why is this old book on the floor? I got old book. I can only read pages one and nine. The others are blurred. It's pure esoteric nonsense. What did you get into, Yvonne? <laughs> Let's have a read and see. All right, D relictus. That's one of the pages. <laughs> and then this is all just nonsense. Not, oh, here we go. The desiderium is sealed from the outside world by the sulfur symbol and a layer of lapis fictus, which is red and hard as diamond. It can only be dissolved by arsatio. To obtain arsatio, you need the acids of tartarus, tamed by iron and blessed by sunlight. Okay. That's how we get that door open. That's what that's talking about, right? Is this red door. It's sealed by the symbol, and it's got the blood red hard as diamond shit on it. It's behind the window. Why did he board the window? Why did he board the window? I don't know. Let's, all right, let's start checking the rooms. Oh, the bedroom. I always wanted to sleep, leaving the cur curtains open to feel the morning light. He couldn't stand the sunlight on his face. That's why he slept in absolute darkness, like two vampires. This room could use some sunlight. Let's open the window, then. Boarded. It's boarded. The blinds never worked well, but this is crazy. The lower board is loose. Maybe I can remove it if I hit it with something heavy. Why Why would you want to remove the lower board? 
Okay, is any of this important? Just shit laying on the ground. These are the pieces of a handcraft that I gave to Yvonne. He must have smashed it to the ground. Put all my heart into this present. Damn. Empty glass. Okay, glass. Okay. Nothing important here. That's what we're going to make our mixture with that glass, more than likely. And we're going to pour it on this thing. I don't know how a glass is going to contain enough liquid to burn that shit off, but that's what we're going to do, I'm sure. Let's check in here. Oh, is there someone in the bath? This wrench looks heavy. Maybe I can use it for something. Oh, I got wrench to break off the board off the window. Trope is it used for a short or one for a short film or dumped in the toilet. That's kind of weird. What about all this shit that's smashed and weird? I used to keep my things in the cap. Oh my God, there's blood on the window. Now it's full of crap. It's cracked and there's blood in the glass. Did he break it with a punch? He was never a violent person. Jesus. Among the shampoo and the lotions, there are some developing chemicals. Simply, specifically, those that smell horrible. Yvonne kept those here because he didn't want to con contaminate the whole house. I won't touch them. Okay, so we got a wrench from the bathroom. Big bloody mirror. I wonder if he... I don't know. Uh-oh. Something smells really bad. What? It's the short film. He burnt the film. Why? The short is what he loves the most in the world. Damn. What the fuck is wrong with this dude, man? What does this book say? Chemistry book with highlighted sentences. Tartaric acid is one of the key components used to alter colors in the developing process. Blood is another iron-rich substance. Oh! Do I gotta put the blood in the glass? Kitchen counter is quite dirty. Nothing important. Okay, because there's blood in the, in the mirror. It's almost empty. There is a developing chemical that needs to be kept in cold storage. I remember it was one of the most expensive. Developing chemical. Empty. Okay. But, fuse box, nothing strange. But if I take the blood, put it in the glass, mix it with the developing chemical, maybe that'll get us into the room? Maybe. Is that crazy? It might be crazy. Let's see. Can I use the glass here? I can't believe I will use this blood. It's dry. I don't know how to add it to the glass. Oh! Ouch! How stupid. I cut myself with a glass. Well, I guess my own blood will do. I got glass of blood. Okay, nice. Now, can I combine that with this? Glass with chemical and blood. I think this mix needs something else. Oh, I'm still missing something. Okay. What else am I missing? Are we sure? We're sure I can't just splash that bitch right here? Can't use this here. Damn. Okay, well, maybe it did say something about this board. That's the only thing I can remember it saying something about. So if I pull this bitch out, control and space. Bap. 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 Sunlight sneaks in a little. Okay. Then. Now what? Oh! The liquid in the glass turned into a strange color and gives off a lot of heat. I got Arisatio. I just put that in the light. That was that was such a long shot. I didn't think that that was going to work. So now, can I use this here? It said I needed Arisatio, right? It seems dangerous to touch it. Oh my god, here we go. The red thing melted. I can enter now. But do I want to? Maybe those weren't just nightmares. What the fuck? What happened here? It's that red, red substance again, hard as stone. It's like a little... He reviews movies for a prestigious website with his computer. He's a pretty harsh critic. The screen is broken. Everything's broken. I kept the short film cans in this box. It's empty. How about this candle? Looks like Yvonne wrote it. I can forget her. I can't forget her. No matter how hard I try, I can't forget Julia. Ever since she left, I do nothing but think about her and suffer her absence. They promised me they would help me forget her. They say the first step is to descend through the elevator to the lowest floor. Forget me to move on with his life? What have you done? What kind of lunatics have you been messing with, Yvonne? There's something on the floor. I got a green candle. Huh. There, these are the costumes we use in the short film. Okay. 
I bought this plant in the worst moment of our relationship. I needed to see something flourishing because our relationship was dying. I see that Yvonne let it die once I left. Jesus. Yvonne's cell phone is stuck to the floor by the red thing. The screen's cracked, but the phone might still work. Shit. Battery's dead. Plug it in, man. All right. So here's what we need to do. We're going to go down into the elevator. Uh, we're going to get in the elevator. There's something weird. Whoa. It's as if the air was different. Bro, it's... Oh, fuck. We stepped into Yvonne's ritual. It's locked. has an engraved symbol. We stepped into Yvonne's ritual room. Now everything's all weird. I got lavendolium. It's locked. Locked. Who opened the door? This is so cool. Oh, that's not very cool. tried to kill me it looked oh what was all i dreamed real or am i still dreaming there's a piece of meat where the creature was standing it's grayed up like rotten i don't want to touch it Bruh. locked locked okay what do we have right now i got a, a candle lavendolium oh it heals let's consume that then yummy yummy because i have a wrench and really nothing else wrench and a fucking green candle uh right but what i don't i don't have really anything i don't really know oh maybe maybe now maybe now after i killed that bitch i can go outside down the elevator yeah that's what's going on here okay do we want to go down that yeah, let's go down the elevator we got to take the elevator down to the bottom floor and that's where yvonne should be this nightmare has just begun Thanks for playing the demo. Damn, I wanted more! Oh, that was too short, you guys. Don't forget to wish this game. Okay, that was so cool. I love that. That that was so cool. The the movie cutscene bit was like insane. It was incredible. Anyways, hope y'all enjoyed the Tenebris Somnia demo. And if y'all did, make sure to like the video, subscribe to the channel. Let me know in the comments if you want to see the full thing when it releases. I'll probably be playing it anyways because that was pretty fucking cool. Anyways, thanks for watching. Love y'all. Appreciate y'all. And I'll see you tomorrow with another video. Goodbye.